One of the camps here in Guantanamo is still completely off limits for the media and even for some lawyers. That's Camp 7, where Khalid Sheikh Mohammed, the alleged mastermind of Line 11, and his four co-conspirators are currently. The media is usually taken on tours of the camps and they're keen to show how things have changed. For example, they show us this is a classroom where the detainees can learn English and different subjects. But there's also very significant to see that when they come and take classes, they're still shackled to their desks. It is really difficult to understand and see what life is like here inside the Guantanamo cells. We're shown the cells, obviously the individual cells, without the detainees, and that's all the access we have. We're not allowed to interview them. But objects here within these prisons do remind us of the things that have happened here. These chairs that you see right here have been used many times to force feed the detainees who have gone on a hunger strike. For the detainees who are either on solitary confinement or those who cannot have communal privileges, who cannot talk to each other, they have to pray in their individual cells. And under the mattresses, they have an arrow that points to the direction of Mecca. For most of the detainees, their situation has not yet been determined and they're still in a legal limbo. Some of them have been cleared for release but are remaining here because their countries will not take them back. Many of them were hopeful that when Barack Obama promised to close it and, and in the camps, as you can see, there is a copy of the executive order signed by the president, things will change here. But as it is right now, everything is pretty much the same. Three more months have gone by and yet the place is still operating as usual. Six of the detainees, including Omar Khadr, who is here in this camp, are scheduled to face a military tribunal, a slightly modified version of the Bush-era tribunals. Monica Villamizar, Al Jazeera, Guantanamo Bay, Cuba.